Hi, my name is Sandra Zamora and I'm here with How Design University in association with TypeCamp to teach you about brush pen lettering. The first thing that you need to do when you try any pen is you want to know how that pen works. The first strokes that you're going to be making are going to be consistent with pressure and slant. So you're going to learn how, this week you're going to practice and learn how to make the strokes on the paper where when you press it down it's consistent and it's spaced well next to the person next to it and you have a consistent slant. I mean that's kind of a hard, um, uh, that's kind of a big tall order, I know. The, the slant we're going to be writing at is about a 70 degree slant and that's based on a 90 degree vertical. So the next strokes we're going to do are from release to pressure. Press to release. Press to release. Press to release. This is going to teach you how to have control of taking that pen from the widest point to the tip. Then you're going to do the reverse. You're going to take it and you're going to have pressure, I mean light pressure to heavy pressure. So next is height. You're going to be working with let letter forms or spine strokes that are short all the way up to different heights. So you'll have to, you'll want to practice doing those as well. And also line weight. Line weight is going to be really important. Then strokes and then make them a little bigger as you go on. This is teaching you to control how much of the pen is touching the paper at any one time. Probably the quintessential lines that you're going to see in brush lettering and those are the strokes, the curved strokes, where you have an entrance stroke that goes up and a, another down stroke that may curve, an entrance stroke that comes around and makes that same arc curve, or maybe your thicker stroke is being heavy on the way around like this. Maybe it's being heavy on the way down. Let me fix that up. Or down and around as if you were making a J or a Y or a G. 